Welcome back, Real Warriors, to another edition of Matt's on the Move. This is the Saturday edition. We're going to go ahead and head on up to Fresno. Uh, I'm already on my way. Just stopped to take a leak at a rest stop. And we're going. So, if you guys do any of the gig apps, apps like Uber, Uber Eats, Postmates, Amazon Flex, DoorDash, Instacart, Shipped, you're in the right spot hit subscribe hit the like button please letting youtube know that i'm doing a good job and also giving me that feedback as well all right so we're gonna go ahead and have a good day see if we can't hit another eight nine hour uh shift again maybe even longer and yeah all right let's go get this money All right, first order was almost nine bucks. Instacart, uh, Restaurant Depot. Got that done, delivered at the mall, Fashion Fair. Uh, and then as I turned on DoorDash while walking to my vehicle, I got one at McDonald's to deliver to a store in Fashion Fair. So anyways, that was pretty cool. Found out that they had a uh, valet parking. And uh, now I'm on to a $14 delivery only for Instacart. So let's go get it. All right, guys, got both of those dropped off. Really chill. GPS tried to mess up the second uh, delivery. Thankfully, I know what I'm doing. On to the next one. Last hundred bucks till we hit a thousand, baby. Yeah, let's get this money. All right, guys, got that. Little Caesars delivered. Ate something, I forget what it was, ate and changed. Then, uh, looks like I'm gonna be a pizza guy for a little bit because we got a Pizza Hut delivery. Check out the tattoos. <laughs> got a Pizza Hut delivery, 12 bucks for 4.8 miles. Boom, I'm gonna take that. Yeah, boy. Yeah, buddy. I'm gonna take that anyways. So, we're gonna go ahead and go get to this money. We are getting ever so close. To that thousand uh, dollar mark and which is also like for this week it's going to be really awesome considering i worked less than uh six hours monday through wednesday so so literally all that money is coming from uh coming from thursday friday saturday although tuesday i made a 200 dollar day but that's just because uh some stuff rolled in and the way those work I count it for the week that it comes in because then I have to go down and add it to the previous two weeks so that's just how I do that everybody's different I get it money's money but I look at it like yeah sure it was for the past two weeks you know but it's income this week because this week I got it so I'm sure everybody's gonna have their own feelings about that, but either way, let's go get this money, buddy. All right, guys, with that uh, pizza pickup, trying to get an extra bag, and they try telling me some crazy stuff about they want to charge 30 bucks for those pizza bags that we get for free from uh, Little Caesars and other pizza places. Why? <laughs> What's wrong with you? Anyways. Uh, yeah, so now we're going to go make this money. Let's go get it delivered. All right, got that uh, delivery taken care of. Boom, got another pizza one. They tried to stack me with just way too low of a payout. I was not going to take it. But uh, yeah, so here we go. On to the next one. All right, guys, fortunately could not record anything. person came out to meet me in my car, so oh well. Uh, that was really cool, though. Uh, real cool interaction. Now we are about 40 or so away from 1K for this week. So let's go get that money, buddy. Ah, I'm stopped at a stoplight. I do jam out when I drive, though. I hope all y'all have a great day. Hey, a little bit of an update for y'all. I am less than a hundred bucks away 
for that 1K a week. Woo, 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 woo. All right. Now we're off to go pick up a $14 donut order. Delivering it to the cops, probably. Let's go get this money. Oh, yep. Yeah. That was pretty cool. That guy told me that they were doing Porch Fest up here where a bunch of uh, bands play on the porches of houses in the area. So looking forward to uh, the night being busy because of that. All right, let's go get this money. Going to a grub hub at BJ's restaurant, 32 bucks. Yeah. That's the first ever walk in, grab it and go for a grub hub order. Around here, normally you typically gotta wait. All right, let's go deliver this and get this money. All right guys. This grub hub will put me just a few dollars away from hitting 1K. So, that's good. But then also, this puts me in Clovis. Clovis has a higher median income than Fresno does. Which typically means better tips. More frequency of orders. So let's go deliver this and get this money! Just picked up a grub hub at BJ's, headed to Clovis. Clovis has a higher median income, which means more money. Anyways, I walked in and walked out with this order. It was crazy how fast that was. They were already ready. And it's a $32 payout. Yeah. Hope y'all are having a wonderful day. All right, a little bit of a wait in Applebee's. Not too shabby, still got it at the pickup time. Got to meet another Dasher. Shout out to that guy. Should have asked for your name, sorry about that. Happy dashing everybody, hope everybody's having a safe one. All right, let's go pick up this other order at uh, Red Robin. $5 tip action. Let's go deliver the next one. Got the last one delivered. That was a lot of walking. So much fun getting in my steps. But uh, yeah, so got this other one for Bombay Pizza. Man, one of the first jobs I had out of Job Corps was being a busboy for the Bombay Grill. And oh, I love Indian food. It's so good. I just gotta say, whoever came up with the idea of putting Indian food on pizza, another one of my favorite foods, is a genius. And they should definitely go to heaven for sure no matter what they do <laughs> i'm just kidding no but seriously though they should really they should be awarded it's it's amazing anyways so we're gonna go ahead and do this 1450 for uh less than seven miles and uh yeah i'm gonna go ahead and kill it tonight all right let's get that money baby hello all my rope warriors welcome back this is the end of the night recap all right did pretty good, did one grub hub for uh, 32, and uh, did almost 50 uh, with the Instacart, definitely a few Bevmo runs, that was fun, and um, did the bulk on DoorDash 118, got a $5 cash tip for, I want to say it was the Mo runs that I did. I don't really remember, but uh, oh no no no, it was a uh, it was a DoorDash order. That's right up in Clovis. Anyway, so I had a really good day. Ended up uh, only working a little over eight hours to make uh, 202.91. So I'm feeling pretty good about that. Um, my gas gauge is looking still almost full. And I had this one order though. Don't ever trust the uh, DoorDash support. Not all of them are great. Um, it was an issue with an 
alcohol delivery. Anyways, wrong address, got the new one, I was going to go do it. And, and typically they should just change the address in the system so that the GPS will allow you to complete the delivery. This guy told me to go ahead and complete the, uh, the delivery right where I was at, at the original address, right? And I'm thinking, okay, that's wrong, but uh, I don't know, let's just see how this goes, right? So what I did was I went to the customer verification part, snapped a screenshot so I could do the verification of the ID, which I did end up verifying customer's ID upon delivery. And uh, yeah, I finished it out like I said, so. So um, I get almost all the way to the customer's house in the conversation with that guy because I had a few uh, other things to handle. And uh, anyways, Man, then I couldn't even find the customer's house. Turns out they gave me the wrong freaking address. And it's like, what is wrong with you? So anyways, I had to call support, get them back on the line. Da -da 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 -da. And uh, yeah, so ended up able to deliver. No extra tip, unfortunately. And then I did two more orders after that. Now, if it wasn't for that one alcohol order, right? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you this. That one alcohol order was a hidden tip. It went from like nine something to 11 bucks. It was a decent hidden tip. And then all I needed after that was like nine more bucks. So let's just say 10. All I needed after that was 10 more bucks and I'd have been done. But uh, no, ended up getting uh, two more orders, two little sixes, did those, got those completed. Now I'm on my way home. Ended up getting a bottle tonight that I always wanted, well, today that I always wanted to uh, try for like something like six or eight years now. So finally gonna get to try that out. That's gonna be awesome, feeling pretty good. I'm gonna do some family fun stuff tomorrow. And uh, I'll work in my home zone for like a part-time shift. Gonna try and get DoorDash. I'm gonna try and get another 150 in DoorDash. But we'll see. It's a Sunday, so I mean, Sundays are great. Anyways, had a lot of fun today. Hope you guys all have fun. Stay safe. Uh, met some cool, cool dashers up in Fresno today that I got to chit chat with. That's a kind of like a rare thing, you know. That was fun. So hopefully everybody's having a fun, safe day.